What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred and welcome back to another trailer reaction review. Today we're going to be taking a look at another Pokemon Sword and Shield trailer. Yes, we on the road to Pokemon Sword and Shield. We're going to be getting a ton more trailers and I'm going to be here to review it for you guys. And I want to hear from you guys also in the comment section below. As you guys know, I answer all comments. We're on the road to a thousand subs, 1K. I'm finally about to hit it. And if you enjoy videos like this and you want to be updated on Pokemon Sword and Shield, please hit that subscribe button. Ring the bell. For the notifications as you guys know i do these videos daily i answer all comments so we can have a discussion about the games and if you want to have a discussion with me by all means on any one of my videos drop a comment on it and let's talk about pokemon sword and shield without no further ado let's jump into these brand new trailers yes brand new trailers because we got two of them because of pokemon worlds going on they dropped a trailer on the pokemon american youtube page as well as the japanese one the japanese one is also a minute longer than the american one so like always we probably got new information new more pokemon or whatever the case may be let's jump into it and see what the fuck we got prepare for battle in pokemon sword and shield let's go play okay sword and shield Everything looking normal. Looking like stuff we've seen before. New battle strategies. Okay. Two one two battles, stuff we've seen before. What's new about this? Rotom. Okay, we got Rotom in a battle. Oh, what? Oh, Whoa, is this a new ability? Rotom levitate. Oh, because it's getting canceled. Okay. So they focus in on rooms, new health item, room service. What's that? Lowers Pokemon speed during Trick Room. Oh, okay. All right. New health eject pack. What? We're getting. Oh my god. Yo, they're like highlighting. Pokemon on a competitive scene. New move, what? Breaking, breaking swipe. Move the attacks on all targets. Okay, cool. Uh, what? Is this hitting the building? Uh, some kind of armor reflects any stat lowering effect. Okay. Okay, Dynamax power. The opponent is faked out. Shrug off moves that call you flinch. Okay. No flinching over here for that match Pokemon. My match Pokemon power. Okay, the right two is getting up. Oh my god. This is so beautiful. Look at the Machamp, yo. There we go. Looks so dope, Dynamax. Oh my god. That's, that poor Toki Kiss. That Toki, what is it? Toki Kiss? Not Toki Kiss. Um, I forgot that evolution every name. Oh, it looks so dope. With the double team having one Dynamax behind them, it looks so dope. The attuned opponent even. Oh my god. They look super clean. Yo, they're at Worlds and they showing off battles. That is crazy. This is alright. For all the people that don't know what's going on. Pokemon Worlds is going on, which is basically all the, the, the geeks that are going to be hyped about news like this, about new moves and new fucking hidden abilities and new held items. All the motherfuckers that are going to be geeked out about it are right now in Washington, D.C. at the Pokemon World Championship where they debuted this trailer. So I want to see the live reaction of those people because I know that would have been hype, like to see in the room for the first time that trailer and then you know just see the people's reaction to pokemon company you know catering to those people you know to the people that are going to be playing this game competitively and that's just amazing because after this, all of this you know you the the national deck debacle they're throwing us up on they're throwing us more stuff that we're going to be able to dive in competitively and play or whatever that's pretty cool that's pretty cool the japanese trailer Let's check it out because usually the Japanese trailer last time gave us a whole new fucking thing with the pokey job. So what is this one? This one's one minute longer. It might just be the shit at the end that's like selling the shit. But let's check it out regardless. I'm gonna throw the headphones on even though 
I ain't gonna understand shit, but let's let's dive in. Play. I love how they go news, you know? That 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 shit is fine. See? What is this? Win, lose. That's the online battle stuff! This is gonna be for online battles, okay. Different Pokemon. It's uh, uh this guy. Galissapod. Was in the English trailer? Galissapod? I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, they're showing how it's gonna be looking, yes. Mimikyu. Trick room, okay. We know how this go. It looks super clean, man. Super fucking clean. Super clean. All these Pokemon are Pokemon that we know what's going on already. I think they're just explaining the same thing that we went over on the last trailer. Everybody's level 50. So yeah, this is definitely our online battle. And he's about to do the Gigamax. Okay, cool. The Raichu. Fighting the Machamp. Look at my champ though, man. Yo, my god, this shit looks so good. I've been saying this game has bad animations. Like, what the fuck, my dude? Like, really? This shit looks fucking epic. That shit looks fire. Turn the whole stage frost. Let's go. Bovenite versus Gyarados. And he's gonna do that arm roll. That's why it's longer. It's just basically showing a lot more of the battle. But they did show the intro, which I like. I don't understand why they didn't show that in the American side, too. My son looked like he exploded, and this is just like the stuff they show, right? Yeah. All right, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Again, for context, this uh, you know trailer aired and premiered at Pokemon World. This is for the competitive scene. People that are competing in the Pokemon World Championship right now, today, and tomorrow, this whole weekend. Got to see this trailer live with you know the game's creators and stuff like that. So this is why this trailer was released. It was to be presented at Pokemon World for the people who are gonna the diehards who want to know the new fucking hidden abilities, the want to know the new held items in these games and shit like that. So to me, this is a good. It was a good trailer. Kind of on just the battle side. We didn't see anything story-wise. We didn't see anything outside of like a couple of battles, to be honest. And to introduce new hidden abilities and new items, yeah, that's cool and all. But it wasn't a, you know, to me, when I rank all the best trailers of Pokemon Sword and Shield, this is not going to be top two, top three. You know what I'm saying? It was pretty good. It was a pretty good hype trailer, especially with looking at my champ Dynamax. It just looks so dope. But it, it, again, it didn't just pull me and be like, yo, you know, I'm I'm hyped for these games, obviously. But these trailers, they could have showed the new Pokemon. They could have showed the new, you know, I don't know, new uh, something to get the casuals as well as you know the 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 geeks. That want to fucking have 10,000 eggs to look for, you know, Pikachu with Surf or whatever the fuck may be. You know what I'm saying? So, I understand why they did it. But they should have did stuff to cater to the casuals as well. And I know you're probably saying, yo, the other trailers cater to the casuals. I know, I know, I know. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm being spoiled. 
three out of five. That's going to be my rating for both of these trailers. I'm going to give it a three out of five. It's, it's in the middle. It definitely was dope. And I'm happy to see that they are like, yo, competitive Pokemon players, we haven't forgot about you. Here's new shit coming to the game. Obviously, there's going to be more than this. So it's just like, yo, I can't wait to be on the online scene and just be battling people on the fucking Nintendo Switch on my big screen, yo. Let's go. These games are going to be hype, yo. Let me know in the comment section below. What would you rate these trailers? And yes, both of them. Let's talk about it in the comments. Are you hyped for Pokemon Sword and Shield? Let me know as well. Like you guys know, I answer all comments so let's chat it up down there like always if you want to see more content like this hit that subscribe button i'm on the way to 1k subscribers so help me get there hit that subscribe button hit the notification bell if you want to be notified on the next time i drop a video and we can chat it up again peace i love you guys i'm gonna see you guys on the next trailer reaction review peace like always, guys, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred on Instagram and Twitter, and you guys can bring the conversation there. I'm the American Gamer in Switzerland right here on YouTube, and yes, I'm going to be doing a ton of videos just like this one. So if you enjoy, please hit that subscribe button. Also, hit the like button. It does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned. Ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time I drop a video. Peace. I'm going to see you guys on the next one.